So on day four of Can't Get Online Week, I'm in Ray Village Institute in Lancashire with Ted Lester. And Ted, um, you've been telling us a little bit about um, the problems that not having decent broadband causes in your life. Um, what, what are some of them? Well, I work for an American software company uh, and I work from home. So if I had decent broadband access, I'd be able to, to work from home office. But unfortunately, uh, we don't. We do have a, a satellite service, and that satellite service, it's great, it's a good stopgap, and it's kind of a, I call it a hobby, broadband, um, but it's not fit for purpose to run a business from. So mm. I, I rent an office in a, in a village nearby, uh, and I go there on a daily basis. Mm. Uh, my children, um, they've all been through education, and, and education these days, uh, they're given homework, and that homework is online, so they need to be able to get to it online. And on occasion, my children have been given detention because they couldn't get to that, that homework online. Mm -hmm. uh, my wife is in, she's uh, in full-time employment, but she is taking a degree as well. And so she's in, in part-time education. So she needs to be able to get online. I mean, everywhere in the world, they have really good broadband services. I mean, we've been abroad. We've had broadband on the beach in places. And yet, in the UK, in one of the most developed countries in the world, you know, large parts of it, we just don't have access to it. And it's an essential service. It's as essential as the fire service or education or health. And, and we just don't get it. I mean, we live within the constraint of uh, a service from, from satellite. And as I say, it's a good stopgap, but it's something that only came in literally a few months ago. It's been a, a reasonable service. Uh, and, and really, we're just behind the times. And we're asking our children to educate themselves and prepare themselves to take place in a global marketplace. And, and we're just so far behind the rest of the world.